been wonderful this week uh, to be here at Davos to attend the World Economic Forum. I think it's a very good way for CMU to showcase its successes and accomplishments. It's also an opportunity to learn from our colleagues, from other institutions, uh, and also people from industry and government. There are a number of interactions that we had individually with uh, presidents of other universities, heads of uh, industry, uh, alumni of CMU who have done very well as uh, CEOs. So it's the opportunity to network, uh, to connect with people, to get feedback, and to get some new ideas on what we could do to engage both uh, locally within the CMU campuses but also globally. This week we had a CMU Ideas Lab on the concept of learning outcomes. This is based on something called the Simon Initiative that we launched just a couple of months ago. It involves CMU's unique role in creating new platforms, new methods and tools to impact learning outcomes uh, for K through 12 for undergraduate students and indeed for lifelong learning. I think CMU's greatest contribution is going to be to widen the public's increasing awareness of technology and education to start to think about outcomes and how we can change outcomes, not just access. We don't start with technology, we start with the science of learning. That was abundantly clear today and it was also abundantly clear how much that's needed in the national and international dialogue around technology enhanced learning. 10 to 20 years from now we're going to see in uh, impact of Carnegie Mellon in terms of convincing uh, educational institutions that they can make research a, a regular part of what they do. That, you know, we do, just don't make it up when we go into the classroom, that we can design instruction using science. And we'll look back and say Carnegie Mellon help, really helped make that happen. As a graduate of Carnegie Mellon, I find it quite heartening to find that the school has a very large presence here at Davos. Uh, there aren't lots of schools here. There are a few. Uh, the most prestigious in the, in the world, of which Carnegie Mellon is one of those. We have initiated conversations about collaborations between CMU and institutions in Europe and in Asia. I look forward to following up on uh, many of the things that have happened here in Davos this week.